FarmBot is not just a technology or a business. FarmBot is a movement of people who believe that the future of food is open source and that food is a fundamental human right. So when we came up with FarmBot and when we started developing this hardware and software and data to support this ecosystem, we felt that it was the morally right thing to do to share it with the world, to say, here, take our ideas and build upon them and maybe your innovation can help us and our innovation can help you. And so when we started doing all this stuff, we started building a movement because people said, hey, that's, that's a cool idea. I wanna be involved and I support that. And that involvement and that support can come in many ways. One of the most basic ways to get involved is to go to the forum and take part in the discussion. If you want to build your own farm bot, we have made all of these resources available so that you can build your own device using your own tools and you can really own the technology and the process behind it. If you are strapped for time or you don't have the, the tools and knowledge to build your own farm bot, we've made these kits available for the vast majority of people who just want to get a kit and put it together and get their farm bot working and you know, grow their own food with it, or do research, or use FarmBot as a teaching tool. So these kits, while they are uh, quite expensive right now, uh, we aim to bring the cost down over time, and we're really gonna need your support to be able to do that. Supporting us by purchasing a kit, or purchasing parts from our online store, really helps push this technology forward. We're a completely open source company, which means that everything that we do is put into the public domain for everyone to use by the time our products are publicly released. So by supporting our company, you are really supporting the entire community because we're able to focus the resources from all of our customers and focus them into software development and providing support in the forum and developing the database on Open Farm. Over time, we'll be able to injection mold more components, we'll be able to manufacture at a larger scale, and we'll bring the cost of the product down and also the quality and the ease of use and the reliability up, which will ultimately benefit everyone who's part of this community. The fact of the matter is that even building a farm bot on your own still costs a lot of money. You can go and look at the bill of materials and see what it would take. It's actually almost more expensive than buying a kit from us because you, unless you have all the tools and equipment yourself and you're an expert machinist, it's actually quite difficult to purchase all the components from all over the internet and download all the CAD mo models and send them off to contract manufacturers in your local area and get the parts back and make sure they work. It's a lot of work and, and still very expensive. So developing our business is a really important step in making this technology accessible to more people because we can focus resources, our time and uh, money from people to improve the product, improve the software for everyone in this open source manner. So as you browse the documentation, we'd like you to keep that in mind, that getting involved and pushing this community and this technology forward not only comes via open source contributions, but also supporting our business and other businesses who are producing FarmBot kits. So we thank you for your support and for being an early adopter with us.